with some more hardcore triple X Mario Golf action. Hey, wait a second, that doesn't make any sense. Well, anyway, this time around, I'm gonna be choosing. Well, yeah, Bird will be fine here. And going to the next star tournament, which is the Blooper Star Open. Let's get this started. Hopefully there won't be any funky camera uh, effects like with the lighting like before. Uh, I just changed it to the uh, uh, night setting uh, so the camera will c continuously switch settings. Uh, basically with the night setting I can just brighten up the scene if I need to if it gets a little too dark in Windows Movie Maker later. As I said before with the camera, it is currently still in experimentation, but hey, it still makes for good video. Especially since it doesn't have any scan lines. Woohoo! I can't believe a camera can actually do that. I am very impressed by it. <clears throat> At least when it comes to filming TVs. <laughs> a, camera is, a camera, you know, it's not it's not supposed to be designed for filming a TV, so uh, that's actually pretty special of this camera. Okay, since I'm off the green because I mishit my shot like an idiot, I will be taking this putt from a, quite a distance away here. Downhill, 0.9 feet, and I'm off the green. Let's see how that works out. Eh, that came up way short. A lot shorter than I thought it would. Wow. I might just bogey this first hole. Yee Come on, Birdo. You can do it. You can do it. Oh, you suck, Birdo. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Um, with Birdo here, Birdo in Japan is actually... Um, a cross-dresser in Japan. <laughs> Seriously, someone uh, mentioned that in the comments of my Super Mario Brothers 2 walkthrough, and I was like, what? I didn't know that. And I, I, of course, had to look it up just for some laughs, and I looked, and when I seen it, I, I just burst out laughing hearing about that. I guess they thought that cross-dressing was a little too taboo here in the States or something like that. Oh, no. <laughs> But now that we know it, the, the truth is out on Birdo. And now I've probably scarred you for life. Dang it. <laughs> but I suppose if you're watching my videos, I've probably already scarred you for life. So I guess it's not much different, eh? Alright, down to the green. We're on this beautiful dolphin-shaped island hole here. Actually, the bunker is the dolphin shape. Oh, I didn't get up to the upper tier. You always got to get to those higher tiers, otherwise you're in big trouble. I'm going to hope for the best. Come on. Yeah. I recovered from that birdie. I, was, I, was, I said birdie. I recovered from that bogey because I read it on the screen. I said birdie. Whoopsie doodle. Next hole. Oh, a nice, awesome crane. Or is that a flamingo? I'd say it's close, closer to a flamingo than a crane. Uh, yeah, I'd probably say flamingo. Um... <laughs> Over here, this is kind of a tricky pit pin placement right here because you got that. It's like on top of a mound, um, so almost no matter what, where you hit it, the ball is gonna bounce off into some other direction than the pin. See what you want. You want what you want to do is run it up to the pin, if possible. Um, I didn't quite get it as far as I wanted to, but I think it'll work out just fine. Yeah, hardcore skills. Oh, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. And this is a very, very much island hole, so to speak. The, it's, the fairway is spread apart of, across a bunch of islands, which you, you've got a question right now. How the heck do they get from one island to another without swimming? They, co they couldn't possibly fly, or at least not some of the characters. But then again, I'm questioning game logic again. I guess they could swim, that makes a lot of sense, but you know... Uh, you'd think that they would look wet, but again, I'm questioning the game logic, and that's not something that you want to do, or you will implode the universe. The fringe, oh boy. Oh, this is actually a pretty easy putt. It's downhill and everything, so it'll just trickle right on down into the hole happily. And Birdo is very happy. Oh yeah, doing a little dance with his ring. Aha, I said his, that's right. And his bow. Uh, okay, next up is this hole. This hole is pretty tricky if you don't have a, a good long driver. Uh, a person that can drive long, not a long driver. 
Um, because when you hit your first drive, and since this is a par four, you've got to get on the green in two if you want to get birdie on it. Well, this this green is very much uphill, and uh, where you're shooting from is usually on a downhill lie, so your so your ball is going to come in at a much lower angle than you want, or a lower trajectory. Uh, but I think this is going to be just fine. Ah, oh, I completely mishit that shot, and I'm going to end up in the bunker because of it. Uh, I knew it. I knew it. I call it. You've seen it. And hopefully I can get the chip in. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, baby. Mad dinosaur skills. Actually, what the heck is Birdo, anyway? Like some sort of sucking dinosaur fish critter. I don't know. You know those fish that suck on glass to clean it? How you like to clean the algae off the glass? Yeah, those kinds of fish. They're actually quite handy if you don't have fish that uh, attack them, you know, in the same tank. What am I talking about fish tanks for? Yeah, some fish, if you have a fish tank or something like that, you can have some species of fish together in the same tank. They're not compatible, and they will attack each other, and that is not good for the fish. But again, why am I talking about the fish? I don't know. I just talk about random things. It's what I do in my walkthroughs. Come on, do it, chip in! Ah, so close. I was hoping I could get another chip in right in a row, but eh, I'll take what I can get, and that is a par. Oh yeah, sexy. Wait a second. And never mind. <laughs> Next hole is the abandoned volcano hole. Uh, this is a pretty cool looking hole. You got some dried up volcanoes off to the side there. I recommend you play your tee shot somewhere around here. If you have a character with the my kind of drive or, or a weaker drive, please don't go in the bunker. <laughs> Um, because if you hit any of those uh, lighter green patches of fairways, like the bluish green, that is something new that's on this course. It's called a fast fairway, and uh, when you hit your ball or land your ball there, um, it makes the ball roll a lot more than it usually does. So that can often put you in uh, trap situations, like it, it like it entraps you. Awesome. And that's the point of the fast fairway, really. Um, you, you can also use the fast fairway to gain distance on your drives, but more often than not, you're better off just aiming for the regular fairways because of the, um, how dangerous fast fairways can be. It, it, um, like, like, for instance, if I were to hit the fast way, fairway over here, there's a very good chance I would be right in the water over there, and that wouldn't be very pretty. So I'm just going to aim towards that part of the fairway right there and control it with some backspin. And this is awesome. Look at that rock formation. You're hitting through a shark head. That is just so awesome. <laughs> I don't know why I found that. I find that awesome, but it's just awesome to me. Uh, maybe because I just love Mario Golf, and I love the crazy course formations and stuff like that of Mario Golf. It's just my kind of game, I guess. And, oh yeah, doing much better today than I was yesterday. And, yeah, cross-dressing for the win! He's even got eye block or um, eye shadow on. I think that's eye shadow, right? That purple stuff on his on his eyes there. Oh and, oh, and long eyelashes. Can't forget about the long eyelashes. Maybe they're eyelash extensions. I don't know by Revlon. But uh, wait, wait, don't go in the water. Don't go in the water. Please don't go in the water. Ah, oh, boobers! I, I I call it. I knew it was coming because I seen the camera angle and that put me way back. Ouchie, ouch, ouch. I, I really played that shot uh, way too quickly. I should have thought about my shot before I played it, but eh, things happen. And I'll just play through it. Oh, that reminds me. You can actually cheat in this game, if you didn't know that. Um, by, by saving and quitting, like you go to save and then you quit the game here, um, you can actually restart the whole from the beginning. But that, that is, of course, cheating, as I said, and I do not condone cheating. <laughs> So I always play the uh, golf rounds as legit as possible. Sometimes I save if I really have to, but other times I don't. And I'm almost guaranteed to get a bogey on this hole, but that's okay. And I'm just going to hit it with the E button, no spin whatsoever, and just plop it straight down the hole. And just like that. And I'll accept my bogey with grace. <sighs> I am a sad cross-dresser. Oh. Oh god! 
Never mind. 